Alright, for, so we've got Freely again, we've just grabbed it by the leg and chained it to the chair. Uh -huh. So we're taking the legs away. We'll, we'll give you legs back when you finish this video. Right. Now, bananas and dates. Some people say bananas and dates are bad, and if you're trying to do the raw food lifestyle, you should not eat bananas and dates. So well, what do you think about that? Well, those people aren't doing a raw food lifestyle. If they think that you should eat bananas and dates, then I don't know what sort of lifestyle they're wanting to succeed on, because it's not a high carb or vegan lifestyle. You know, you need bananas and dates. Can't get calories from strawberries? No, not enough. What about mangoes? How many kilos would you have to eat to get the equivalent of 10 bananas? Yeah, a lot. Probably 4 pounds. Yeah. What about what about mangoes? Mangoes, mangoes are good, yeah. You know, they're like, with bananas and dates, they're just higher in carbs. Mm -hmm. Like, what's the carb content? Bananas are like about 22. Yeah. You know, and um, mangoes are about 16. Oh, it depends on the mango. I'm not too sure, but yeah. yeah, they're not they're not too high. They can be hard to get sometimes, can't they? Yeah, exactly. You know, if you can't get bananas and dates, then I recommend people eat like a clean source of carbohydrates, put carbohydrates like rice or pasta or potatoes, instead of being like an emotional you know, Nut job. Crazy like a McDougal style program. Yeah, exactly. It's better to get the carbohydrates in than to starve yourself. But no no what what about what about hundred percent raw? I mean shouldn't you fill up on cashew nuts and stuff to, and absolutely. Matt Monarch's protein powders to, yeah, to be raw? Not. Yeah, it's like the worst idea. So you're saying that McDougal style potatoes and rice is yeah. better than eating cashew, nut butter, and gourmet raw food to stay raw. Yeah. Or you can improve on McDougal and you can have fruit for breakfast, fruit yeah, for lunch, yeah. and then you can have a high carb, more cooked vegan. Mm -hmm. Dinner. Like a McDougal style dinner. Mm -hmm. You know, because McDougal does include all fruit. Yeah. You know, but I recommend to people who want to transition or people who are, you know, wanting to do the lifestyle and like get a lot of the benefits still feel level-headed, but they still, they don't want to get rid of all the food, they do that. Yeah, it's, pro it's probably pretty easy around the world, isn't it? Yeah. Today, you always get rice and potatoes, exactly. especially rice and soy sauce. You know, if you're struggling, you know, eating enough fruit, then you know, don't fret. There's always another option. Why don't fill up on avocados? No, That's a fruit. You know, this, the fat thing, you know, the fat just doesn't satiate our brains. So then we're going to be constantly looking around for carbohydrates. Because you need carbs, don't you? Okay. You know, if you want to be level-headed, yeah, you need to get enough carbs. I mean, like, gosh, I'm not level-headed when I'm not getting enough carbs. Yeah, no one is, are they? No one is. You know, so it's like the fish out of water. Yeah, don't feel like you're a mental case or something. You know, like, if you're feeling a bit crazy, and blah, 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 it's not because you're mental, it's because you're <laughs> just not meeting some basic physiological need that you have. So, not enough sleep, or water, sugar. Yeah. And basically, they're the three that mainly cause people to have mental problems. So what's the take home message? What's the best thing for people to eat? Bananas and dates, that's a staple you reckon? Bananas and dates are the best. Yep. Yeah, definitely. Like jackfruit, if you can get into jackfruit. Yeah, that's pretty hard to get. Yeah. <laughs> that's the ideal world. I mean the yeah. ideal world would be there's fruit every corner, jackfruit falling on the ground, people are slipping up on banana skins, there's lawsuits for someone getting hit by a mango on their head. Oh, there's like criminal proceedings for people who chop down fruit trees. Yeah, and that's the ideal you know, world. Oh yeah, that would be Definitely. So that's the ideal world, but we don't yeah, live in the ideal world. world. Yeah. yeah. So, okay, so the take home message is bananas, bananas and dates, that's your staple. Bananas and dates. Yeah, Josh Frost Greens. That's Josh a good video. Josh Frost Greens video, <laughs> bananas and dates, it's funny. I'll link it down below. Yeah. And then failing that, a McDougal style vegan low fat lifestyle. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
banana sugar. All right, so thanks for that, Philly. It's okay, Carly. Carb up, and we'll see you again. We'll, we'll give your legs back to you now. I'm going down the beach. Going down the beach. So, right. so. Bye-bye.